afterward. Mm. Can we invite some of these people around tonight? Some mm. of your friends? We could have like a dinner and I could meet them. Like, mm. who is this? Mm. No, sorry, no. There, I have this um, work meeting tonight. Yeah. There's the whole English department. On a Saturday? Mm. Yeah. Oh, shit, that's my parents. Um, I just got my parents. You want to talk to them? Mm. Oh, cool. Yeah. Mm. Hi, Mom. May. Hi, Linda. Oh, Georgina. Oh, well, now, don't look at me. I'm 3,000 years old. <laughs> you two are just the vision of beauty and youth, as per usual. How's cohabitation? Oh, it's oh, so it's great. Kind of an adjustment. Oh, Georgina, don't look at me. <laughs> I mean what I say. Hello, darling daughter. Oh, hello, George. <laughs> How lovely. Hi, Dad. How are you? Uh, well, madly in love with your mother, of course. Oh, please stop. <laughs> I'm a repulsive old witch. So, Georgina, when are we going to meet you? I think it's outrageous we haven't met you yet. Um, well, you do live in Canada, yeah. so it's been three months, guys. Chill. Oh, mm. um, your mother and I moved in together after five days. It's true. We're just new. <laughs> now, May, your father and I want to know if you found a new Narcotics Anonymous uh, meeting. A what meeting? A what meeting? Wait, 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 wait. wait. Mom, can you please stop dredging up the past, please? Don't say dredging. That's disgusting. All right, so uh, I'm off. I'm not saying I want to talk about the past, believe you me. I just want to know that you're going to a regular meeting. I've been very busy. I've been moving in with George, and I can't sleep these days. You can't sleep? It's not a big deal. Oh, my God. All right, I think I should just tell you, I think that's because you were four weeks premature. Was I? You were in an incubator, sweetheart. It's why we're not close. Are we not close? And now I have to go. Find a regular meeting. Yeah, bye. Ty, I just found out I'm super premature. You're in Narcotics Anonymous. So you're not allowed at the wedding? She's not allowed a plus one. And you're not allowed to text her? Yeah. You know, when I was a kid, all my buddies grew flowers. Back in Hollywood 92, I mean, you were nobody if you didn't have big, beautiful flowers. And then, on my 13th birthday, my dad finally bought me some seeds. Oh, man, I was so excited. My friends were like, Phil, we heard your dad bought you seeds. Show us your beautiful flowers, dude. But I was too ashamed. I mean, they were just seedlings. So I put them in the closet and they withered and died. If only I just left them in the sun and they would have grown to be big, confident flowers. Are you saying I'm the flowers? No, May. I'm just telling you a story about myself. <laughs> Hi, Mom, can I ask you something? Darling, can you please turn the light on? I feel like I'm talking to a sex offender. Can I ask you something, Mom? Am I needy? In general, yes. Why else would my body have expelled you four weeks premature? You are literally sapping my resources. Okay. Hello, darling daughter. Where's lovely George? Oh, we're um, taking healthy space, apparently. Darling, so. there's no such thing as taking healthy space. <laughs> oh, really? Well, what about when you guys kicked me out when I was a teenager? You took space from me for many, many years. I think I'll just um, pop out to the garden, check on the sparrows. Mm. May, I'm not doing this again. Fine. I, I just can't even remember what I used to think about before George. Well, before George, you thought about Nicole, who was your true love. Before that, you thought about Caroline, who, oh yes, was also your true love. And before that, it was drugs. Oh my god, I'm Pac-Man. Well, I don't understand that reference. I'm Pac-Man. I'm a hungry, empty ghost. Oh, that's actually very poetic. Can I borrow that for my book? How's your book going? Well, it's just extremely graphically violent. Okay, um, I'm gonna go, but I love you. And I will talk to you soon. Goodbye. Okay, I guess that was enough about me.
Hello? Hello? Hi, is this Corn? No, this is, uh, yeah, this is Corn. Yeah. Hi, hi. Um, it's George. Um, she fell through a glass table. There's blood everywhere. It's fucking disgusting. What? Just, you need to come to the hospital now. Is everything I'll, okay? I'll oh, my God. Okay. Sorry, who are you? Um, friend of George's. She's dating George's boyfriend's mum. Is she gonna be okay? We've given her morphine, so. Hello? <gasps> Baby, you came. You came to see me. Please come here. Oh, I love you. I'm so sorry. It's okay. No, it's not okay. Oh, I'm a fucking idiot. I love you. I'm gonna make you come. Ooh, okay, okay. Um, can you open my bag? Doctor, please, can you pass my bag? Oh, oh, Thank you. Look. Oh, my God. Uh, <laughs> I don't think that's... Uh... I'm gonna fuck my girlfriend with a strap-on, Doctor. I'll just get a nurse. Yeah. No. Aw. Yeah. I'm such a stupid idiot. I'm so sorry. Oh, my God. You are so beautiful. Your eyes. <laughs> oh, my God. Welcome to the Horror Hotel. I'm the bellboy, but I've been dead for years. Please keep your hands and arms inside the vehicle at all times. Buckle up. Oh, I'm buckled. <laughs> this is so hilarious. <laughs> oh, my God, I've been on my face until about six. I would like to have a discussion with you, and I would like to enjoy the ride. Oh, my God. <laughs> but why did you kick me out? We didn't kick you out. We asked you to leave. There's a difference. Oh, really? <laughs> oh, my God. OK, but after that, all of those years, where were you? I'm not discussing this. OK, fine. Fine. If you want to talk about it, yes. where should we start? Oh, how about the part where we gave you every little thing your heart desired? Hey, and you hi. threw it away to chase some high. You know, people don't just become addicts. They're running from something. So what was I finding so intolerable? Oh, I'm not going to let you do that. You are not a victim, May. You are a spoiled, <laughs> privileged little girl. Take some responsibility for the choices you've made. You are a drug dealer, a criminal. You stole money from us. You threatened us. You overdosed. You stole my ornamental pears. I never fucking touched those fucking pears. Mate, you have always done exactly what you want, so don't blame me if what you want doesn't make you happy. Oh, fuck! Oh, my God! I'm getting off. Are you on drugs? You know, George, you don't really know her. I, I think I do. <laughs> May, May loves you, Linda. May doesn't love people. May loves the idea of love itself. Doesn't matter who you are, George. You're just a mirror she's holding up to herself. Do you understand? Please exit the train carriage. My daughter is loose in your horror hotel. You're just one of many Georges. That's not fair. <laughs> well, there is a, a certain type, you could say. Uh... What, what type? Heterosexual. She likes the chase, and then when that wears off, there's another in the wings. Maybe there already is one. Tell me this, have you come out yet? Uh, well, I just told my friends. Right. I give it a month. This is completely illegal behavior. Right, okay, I'm leaving. Mom? Oh, I'm going round again. I need to chill out. Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna just go for a walk, too. Hi. 
I... Are you okay? I, I was wondering, um... Would you come over later, like, at like three, for a coffee? I, I just, I just want to say something and I want to show you something. And I, I'm not expecting anything at all. I just, I just... I love coffee. I find it so weird that it comes from beans. What's that? Uh, worms. Um, I was I need to say... To say do you want to... No, no, you go. Okay, yeah. sorry. I want to say that I thought I was doing the right thing ending it, but I think I was just doing the easy thing, and I should have carried your bags. What bags? I don't know, like, like, if, like if you had bags, I, I just should have carried them. I'm confused about the bags, because... No, no, forget it. the bags, OK? It's just, like, symbolic. I, I just... I should have taken care of you. And if I could go back, I would... I'm going to Canada in a couple of days. What? I'm going to Canada, because my parents booked me a flight, so I'm going to go. No, but... Wait, for how long? I don't know, like... Like a while, I think. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. Can I come out now? Yeah. Um, May, May this is my mum. Mum, this is May. Oh. Oh, God. This has all gone rather badly, hasn't it, Di? Shall I do the speech? Well... May, I wish I'd met you sooner, but my daughter's been a dunce. She didn't realise how important... Mum, it's OK. Please stop it. I think it's... I think it's too late. May's made up her mind, so you, should, can, you can go. Sorry. It's nice to meet you. Mm. Yes. You, you look the same. Do we? Yeah. Oh. Not to worry. Mm. You're a mess, eh? Yes. Bye. Thank you, Mum. Bye. I'm really sorry. No, I'm sorry. I it's didn't just, know. It's not just... enough. Sorry. No, it's not you. It's, um, you were right about what you said, that I need to be okay on my own. Yeah. Because what I'm doing is just jumping from thing to thing. And that's not healthy. And that's what I do, is I just jump from thing to thing. I'm not a thing. What? I'm, I'm a person. I'm not a thing. I know. And what, and what if I'm a person and I'm in love with you? What am I gonna do? I don't know what to do without you. What am I meant to do now? I need you now. Oh, God.